Hi Cancer, here's a general look at your solar chart for November 2009. Now the energies this month are going to be lighter, brighter, faster. The energies are going to be around to bring out your more creative side, your more playful side. So this is going to be a period for you to um, enjoy uh, company on that sort of level, uh, but also speculative you may be in a speculative sort of a mood more willing to take a risk on something now and this could relate to financial matters uh, property matters so um, anything from a small possession to a, a, a large property um, whatever it is though you will want to initiate things you won't want to hang around uh, and, and wait, waiting for, for others. You know, you want to be decisive. You want to push things forwards. You want to make improvements to your material situation, your domestic setup, or a project which um, you want to get on with. Uh, and now that project, uh, whatever it is, uh, you could be you're the project. It could be you developing a skill. It doesn't necessarily have to be, you know, a heavy lump of bricks and mortar. It, it might be. Um, that you are developing something and cultivating something which is going to maximize your earning potential for the future. Uh, that's another way the energy can work. That's another way the energy can, can sort of light up that bit of you. So you'll want to, you'll be in that kind of a mood. You want to initiate, you want to push forwards um, and that can also be re in relationships too. Uh, but you're very you are you not you are the nest maker of the zodiac. You're very you're very security conscious. You know you you want protection. So you want to protect what you have already, and this can be in physical uh, ways, but also in more emotional ways. In in you know um, uh, uh, it's it's almost this feeling of, of, of you know putting a fortress really uh, around you and of course your sign cancer the crab uh, has this hard little shell around it that that's the armor that you that you feel safe within because you are the being within that shell so this month uh, yes very much focused on security and uh, your material situation uh, your domestic setup maybe or a project uh, which you may be working on uh, you also may find that you have to stand up for yourself. You've got to stand up for your heartfelt values in the face of opposition or resistance or other kinds of difficulties. But um, I think actually in the first eight days, if it's to do with family members who are being obstructive in some way, whether they mean to be or not, but uh, that's the way it is with families, um, th you, you'll be feeling really quite anchored and and stable inside and able to deal with it um, even after even afterwards uh, but during the first eight days that's the time when it will be easier to shake hands on something also uh, that that will also be the time for you to set the ball rolling to make these improvements related to uh, maybe the whole home base uh, or uh, beautify your environment, you know, hang hang something nice on the wall. It could be on that level that you're responding to this energy, you see. So for some, it, it can mean that kind of thing. For others, it can mean that you're just really appreciating your surroundings. So maybe you're not at home, maybe you're somewhere else. Um, and you're really getting a, a, a buzz or a kick out of this you know the place that you're in or the people that you're with um, wh whatever it is uh, you will be enjoying the community uh, the, the neighborhood uh, everything will just seem more friendly and attractive uh, or if it's not consciously like that it just means that things will run smoother during that first eight days now from the from from the 8th of um, November you're still in this lovely, light-hearted uh, sort of a, a mood. Chances for you to go out and party will be more likely. Um, the focus, yeah, is still on things financial and to do with mis uh, material security, but you're coming from this place where your vibration is faster, so you're able to make these decisions regarding assets or buying or selling 
or you know, um, perhaps developing a skill which is going to maximise your earning potential in the future. Domestic setup may present uh, problems um, if you are, you know, trying to do things there, uh, renovating, you might be trying to relocate, uh, and as I said before, it could be that your interaction with family members hits a snag or two, but because there is this nice energy around, uh, uh, there could be more entertainment around for you, and yes, romance cancer as well, because this energy will definitely set off that particular trend in your life if you're ready and if you're in the market for that. So affairs of the heart are going to be highlighted uh, and also connecting with children more. They will be more important in some way or animals, pets or other types of animals may be more of a factor uh, as you get the chance to be, I don't know, to interact coming from this more childlike place yourself in the first uh, three weeks. Definitely a period uh, where you're going to be made to feel special in some way or empowered in some way because somebody else out there could even be an animal just sort of uh, um, gives you the vibe that you are somebody, you know, to be appreciated, somebody uh, special or it could be a person also or as you might think some people are a little bit like animals uh, and uh, vice versa as well. So a love relationship could be highlighted too. Now Saturn's recent move is going to affect the roots of your life for some time to come Cancer. Um, it, Saturn has shifted into your domestic area there to stay for two and a bit years and so just a little bit about that. Well it means that your physical foundations you're just going to have to get more serious uh, about uh, things uh, and maybe g g go to a little bit more trouble uh, related to your physical foundations, your, your domestic setup, but also your emotional foundations and uh, elements of the past and how things have been for you in the past. You can really get busy at uh, sorting out those types of things and doing maybe some inner work over this next two and a half years. Um, but it could be that something that was set in motion some years ago is only now coming to fruition, Cancer. And so you're going to be reaping what was sown then. Also, I think you could get a second shot at something, uh, a second chance at something which maybe was curtailed in the past for whatever the reason was. Um, and so it, it, during this period when Saturn is in this area of your chart, your attention may be on um, picking up the threads of something that was left behind a long time ago. Another way it can work is that it highlights parents or somebody that you view uh, you know, in that light as, as, a, as a parental or authority figure. Uh, and also another way it works is it, it, it can um, uh, focus your attention more on, on your ancestry um, or maybe it's your soul ancestry. You might you know, uh, be more aware of that. Tribal connections or interest in honouring or exploring your personal history but also the bigger picture in history, getting more interested in that as well. Skeletons could be rattling in the cupboard a little bit. Um, depending on your individual situation but also I think something or someone is going to come along to stabilize your life make it more secure it may be just the hard work you're doing on yourself whatever it is inwardly you should be listening to your deeper self uh, and your deeper needs and making the external choices in your life to reflect what it is you really feel inside well that's it for November if you know your rising sign have a listen to that too